This one looked. Got him. No, spat out. Did you see that? As you can see, not much is happening in the area underwater. Obviously, from time to time you will see that the camera will move and it means that I'm fishing in very, very fast water. Actually, I had to put quite a bit of stones onto my tripod to make sure that my camera is not moving too much anyway. You will see just more or less a little bit to the right, the whitest bit is my hook bait and that's a piece of muscle so I will start feeding now and hopefully you will see how quickly those fish will respond and hopefully we will see some of the pellets I'm chucking in going through the peg also you should be able to see my lead it's in the left bottom corner there and my main line is going as well from it towards my rod Now I will feed until the fish will start to compete, you know. It's early days, it's middle of the day, so I don't expect lots of action soon. But again, I don't, don't think that I'll have to wait, you know, very long until I will, starting, will be starting to see big fish, you know, around. I have some ground bait with me as well, which is like mixed with pellets. I will chuck a little bit of that as well, just to see, you know, how it's landing. Yeah, now you definitely can see a few pellets around my hook bait and small fish are trying to eat them. Very, very good sign. So I worked out where to chuck them, which is great. But as you can see, the water water is very, very fast, guys. Very, very fast. As I say, camera is just moving from time to time. I mean, still, it's a good shot. Just I was not able to fasten it any better. Yeah, this one went in beautifully. I should be able to see. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and Chubb is coming. How about that? <laughs> How cool is that? Can I catch him? As you can see, my hook bait is uh, just a little bit too zell right of the shot like moving a little bit around because the flow is you know moving it yeah it was the first big job i saw very cool very cool guys let's wait and some more will turn up i'm certain how cool is that guys wow and another one I think was a little bit further. Very cool. It's really, everything is working out nicely so far. Even though I had no like attempts to eat my hook bait from the chop, but yeah. They are, as they say, they are streetwise. But where I am, I mean, I'm getting some activity from a right species already, which is super, really. And once they will start to compete, hopefully, you know, I will start to catch them. Chubb is just sitting right in the middle, almost. Again, just not eating, just kind of swimming about, alone. No just chucked one ball of ground bait oh that chub actually fed how cool was that
Beautiful shot, guys. Really, really nice. Wow. Come on, chop. Go a bit downstream and eat that hook bait. Just look at that, guys. <laughs> wow, beautiful it was. Very, very nice shot, guys. Very, very nice. And this one actually fed, kind of grabbed a couple of pellets from the bottom, which is fantastic. That chub is back. Well, some chub. And one is coming from behind as well. I just might catch him. It's coming. It's look. Oh. Wow, that was cool. That chub just cooped one pellet. Come on, small fish, leave my hook bait alone. Those will be days, I guess. Come on, you chop, just drop a little bit. Just a half a meter downstream and, you know, it will be good, good television. I'm certain of it. And obviously if that chop would drop a little bit down, so small fish would go away as well. Yeah, I am able to keep that chub. What's that? Another fish was further away. So that's what I want. A couple of fish, you know, moving around and then I, I will catch one. See how cool was that? That chub was chasing one pellet. Very, very nice. We'll feed a couple times just downstream just to make sure that the chub is going up the downstream as well. And then hopefully I will catch him. Come on, Chub, just drop downstream a little bit. He's not doing it. Went away. Come on, you Chub, where are you? No, disappeared. Come on, Chub, come back. What is that? Another Chub is coming, but smaller one, I think. Yeah, it's feeding. Fed a little bit, but quite close to the hook bait, I think it was. Yeah, yeah, go for it. Feeding is coming. Yes, yes, I think two of them are coming. I know a little bit further actually than I was thinking. But this is good, this is good guys. I should I should catch one hopefully soon. Wow, that one just was about to chase that pellet, you know, which was going closer to the camera but then stopped. Try to feed a little bit downstream just to make sure that the fish are dropping a little bit downstream as well. Yeah, another one is coming. I'll catch this one. See? Try it. This one tried actually, but it did not take it properly. See how how fussy those chub can be? This one actually just kind of like touched the bait with the lips, but did not suck it properly. Insane. This one? No? See, they are trying to push, like starting to push uh, each other a little bit. This is exactly what I'm trying to create, guys. Or create, should I say. Once they will start to compete, then I will catch them. That's the only way with the chub. That's the only way, guys. See, but I, I chucked a, a little bit, like a couple of handfuls. Well, probably 30 pellets, a little bit further downstream. And fish are dropping a little bit downstream as well. Great to see. You know that what I'm doing is actually working. Another one is coming just behind this one. No, did not did not come closer, but yeah, now I have two chub in, in the swim. This is great, guys, this is great. I should catch one soon. 
They are like buses, just look at that. Oh, it's coming, it's coming. No, avoiding my hook baits they are. They are taking just moving baits. They are not taking anything static yet. As they say, those chub are very, very clever. They know what to do. They've seen it all. See, that chub is feeding and one is coming from behind. Huh? Yes, 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 drop a little bit back, you. Yes, yes, just drop a little bit, just a touch, yes. Definitely sees that hook bait, but obviously he sees that. Uh, yes, this one. It's very close. I will get this one. No, Fed three of them, proper buses. Something spooked them, but it wasn't me, I think. I did not, did not move. A lot at all. They will be back, I'm certain. Yes, here it comes. This is exciting, guys. Feeding them chub and waiting, you know, for one to make a mistake. How about that for a shot? <laughs> if I would have a float now, like on a float rig, some any bait I would be catching. I've caught this one. It's coming, it's close, it's close. No, went away. My hook bait is a little bit in the right, as you can see, it's moving a little bit, like when the flow is picking it up. Why is they avoiding? Why is they avoiding the... Well, obviously they are avoiding because they see the hook or the line, something. Or just they are not seeing anything, but they know that it's safe to eat the bait which is actually moving they are avoiding any feeder or ledger rigs because they've been caught on, on them multiple times two fish as you, as you saw just pushed each other wow This one is like a tank, very fat one. Just feeding, beautiful. Another one is coming, just eat that hook bait. Yes, it's close. Eat it, eat it, eat it. No. Thinking, you know, in that fast flow, they won't be double checking my rig too much, but still, even now, in that fast flow, when they have to work very hard to keep in that flow, you know, the. Uh, the uh, you know seeing what they know it's not safe i'll catch this one it's closed that one is blocking with its tail no on the way come on you chub wow very impressive very very impressive guys I definitely can't keep this chub in the shot as as long as they want, just look how cool is that guys. <laughs> wow. Also guys, whilst I have you here, whilst I feed this chub, very important piece of information. So if you could please consider becoming a member of my channel Andrew Snots. It would really help for me to create many many more videos like this one and even better ones so please i will leave a link in the description below click on it and join my group of members and obviously it will be very beneficial for you i believe first of all i will answer all your questions as quick as i can and secondly once I will reach 100 of members then I will allow some members to see my videos with ads disabled for some time so basically you will be able to see my videos without any disturbing ads how about that this chub is really really wanting everything very very cool that chub is very close to my hook bait very very close I know, just went a bit past, but um, 
another fish is coming from from further away I think okay let's feed out the downstream again just to make sure that you know that they will start coming up from see how cool was that it was very very cool that chub is where is it I just see that chub's lips very cool that was wow I almost tamed this one <laughs> just luck just luck I checked some pellets in and that fish is just feeling that those pellets will come past him soon just waiting for them to go past and that fish will snatch them once they do some more pellets just look at that chub wow very very nice grabbed one Definitely I can keep this chub in the shot for as long as I want. <laughs> Just see, it's feeding. Another one is coming. Two of them. Wow. They are like a buses, guys. Very healthy and just seems like perfect, you know, fish. They don't have any missing scales from what I can tell. Like looking quickly, even though they are moving all the time, you know, in that fast flow. Where are the, ro the overs? See, that chub is feeding like catching god pellet which is going past him. Beautiful. Very, very nice. Evening sun picked up actually. And those rays are just playing on the bottom and on chub's back and sides. Pretty slick, right? definitely tamed this chub as they say I can keep him in the shot as long as I want it's not bothered about my rig too much probably he knows where everything is you know and just that fish is making sure not to eat <laughs> my hook bait and not touch my my lion you know basically that chop is being very very sneaky as they are all the time actually my hook bait now is almost out of the shot we'll have to drag it closer to the camera I guess now it's just too far We'll wait for the chub to go away. We'll not feed for a for a minute, you know. <laughs> Hello. It's a beauty. It's like a proper tank. Very fat and healthy fish. Wow. Oh, yum. <laughs> go away I want to reel in and recast probably will have to do it regardless because now I'm just wasting time 
Is that another chub is coming? Yeah. <laughs> Stopped from feeding for a minute already, probably. And still they are, you know, swimming about. two chub now in there. Uh, my bait actually moved a little bit into the shot but it's moving like left and right just slightly from time to time. Hello Mr. Chub, you are a tank. You are a tank. Just showing off really exactly in the middle of the shot. It was for a minute. Just luck. <laughs> wow. Wow, he is a beauty, guys. That fish knows exactly where the rig is, where the hook bait is. Just know where to, you know, to be to avoid any detection at all. Yeah, but my hook bait is a little bit too far, so let's reel in and see how that chub will react. Will it spook, will it not, you know, just for le learning purposes, I guess. It's definitely coming back to this area all the time, that chub is. Just luck. <laughs> wow, beautiful shot, guys. Definitely this chub is showing off, just see, coming exactly in the middle of the shot. Hello, hello Mr. Chub, how are you? Luck, luck, luck. <laughs> Chased away some days or whatever it was. Look, he's digging like a, like a bubble wood almost. Nice, nice, nice guys. So I will try to get my hook bait now a bit closer to the camera and where, you know, where Chub's mouth is more or less there. Maybe then I will catch him, not sure. Okay, we'll reel in and we'll cast out and we'll see how this fish will react. Probably will spook, you know, as soon as I will grab my rod. No, cannot believe actually I reeled in and the chub is still in the shot, cannot believe. Hmm. So I tamed this one properly. Okay, the chub is still around, cannot believe. Okay, I will check out and I definitely will spook him. That was actually a good, good shot managed to get out on the first cast, which is very, very good. Yeah, believe it's there, that's good, that's good guys. My lead is just out of the shot and my hook bait is right in the focus. Perfect. So as you can see that chub disappeared now on the cast. Let's start feeding a little bit and it will come back, I'm certain. And I need, you know, him to come back, otherwise those small fish will destroy my hook bait. Wow, it did not take long, probably a minute and the chub is back, so it's a good like good information you know that chub are not going that far away it's close come on just take that muscle please mr chub see that flow i mean i'm using fluorocarbon and everything and even then my hook bait is moving from time to time this one is coming no i think he saw that bait it's coming for it no i ah, know a bit further away, swinging it will, it will go for it. Wow, beautiful shot, guys. I have some some twig around the camera, which is not great. Annoying, really. Free chop now. They're starting to compete. Interesting, so 
they definitely not they are not caring about you know a rig going in probably because they are so good at detecting that rig they know where it is what to look for what to avoid and stuff it's really annoying that I have something on the camera and I don't want to you know well it's not even a risk I, I would definitely spook them if I would go you know into into the water and clean that bit of weed or whatever that is around the camera come on what is that some some something is well, was trying to eat my cook bait we have a couple chub one I think is coming no I think he looked but that one was smaller fish much smaller fish <laughs> How cool is that? This one is looking, yes, go for it, no? Now we have two chub in front of the camera. It's that big one and small one behind. Wow, that big is feeding properly. Some small fish almost moved my hook bait out of the shot, but the flow then corrected it, which is great. Chub is coming for it. Yes, yes, go for it now. Wow. It's very, very exciting stuff. Yes, go for it. See, as, as soon as that hook bait starts to move a little bit, kind of chub almost tries to chase it you know because it kind of thinks it's a moving bait and it's safe to eat it but now then it stops and chub just runs away again oh i'm thinking thinking this one will go for the hook bait like at speed but now it stopped but they are starting to compete now see guys they're definitely starting to compete now. Just eating good pellets. See, they are going at speed now, which is great. Once, once I will have you know a couple of fish doing that, I will. This one no, I think it will go for it, but no. This is cool television. I need more chub, you know, in my swim, and then I should should be getting bites from them. Yes, yes, go for it. Yes, 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 yes. Ah, no, see that one almost like kind of almost went for it. This was the, the closest, I think. Wow, wow. Yes, yes, yes. No, I think this one related. Three chub now are in, in my peg. Three good chub. My hook bait rolled a little bit, but stopped them, which is great. Those chub are definitely start, you know, to kind of push each other, which is good. Those two from behind are coming. Now stopped. This one is two of them actually. Yes, just go for that hook bait. No, some small daisies in the mix as well. Just look, they are like tanks pushing each other. Wow, that is pretty short, guys. Very, very nice shot that was. They are starting to compete, definitely, guys. Should get a shot soon. At least I hope <laughs> so. This one is close. Two of them. Yes, 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 yes. Did you see that? 
this job actually aids the hook bait and spat it out without any like detection at all. As you see guys, they are so good, they are so good. Wow, that was impressive. Just hook bait with a super duper sharp hook went in, out. No chance of hooking it. I mean, yes, see that now they are competing. Uh, I mean, probably it will take a couple more of times, you know, for them to suck in and maybe one I will get lucky and look and uh, hook one, you know, but just only when they are competing you will be able to get a bite in the first place. That's, that's great. I mean, uh, I knew that anyways, but now it's just good to see what exactly is happening, that you are not hooking like most of the chub. They are avoiding you. Like, they are swimming and eating everything around the hook bait without you knowing and then sometimes or often they will try to eat your hook bait and again you won't hook them. But see, this one, this one did not even take the hook bait, just kind of, kind of, I don't know, like touched the hook bait with the lips. Very, very cool television, guys. That wig is still messing about. But now they are competing, actually. Three, four fish sometimes, see? And they are going like at speed, they are kind of losing the cautiousness, cautiousness, if that's a correct word, bit by bit. And that's, that's what you want with the chub. That one from behind, that's a smaller fish still. I'm not sure. That wig kind of blocked the view, but I'm not 100% sure. It's coming again. That's cool, guys. That's cool. Very, very nice television. Another one is coming. See, I have some chub in the area all the time now, which is great. This is what you want. You want to keep them in your peg and, you know, like build the swim. So the more of them you will get, the more competition you will get. And one will make a mistake at some point. See, they are getting more aggressive and like more of them and they, they will just make a mistake. One of them, I'm certain. Three of them just look, they are mopping. This one just avoided my hook bait. See, in out. It was like split of a second, in out. Insane, insane. So what I had like three of these already and I have, as they say, super duper sharp hook. Sharp hook. This one is coming, no? Three fish are feeding and competing in that fast flow. Four actually now, wow. I got them feeding bad, guys. I got them feeding bad. They're going for it now. And see, all small fish are gone. None of the small fish actually in the shot now. Zero. As they say, those smaller fish, they do not want to become a lunch, so they just vanished. Oh no, I mean, but they are, they are close by. They are just taking what's available after chub. But they are very, very cautious, you know? They know that chub can easily swallow them. Just look, they are pushing themselves. Wow. See? Chub went away a little bit and small fish came back immediately. They just put a little bit more of pellets in and chub are back like in five seconds. Wow. They are decent fish. That one especially is a big fish, I think fat and everything, and a couple smaller ones. I have to make sure that I'm not feeding too much upstream because it seems that those fish are kind of wanting to come upstream. This biggie, that one is like a bus. Proper one, that is. Some other one is coming as well. Yeah, just eat that hook bait now. Wow, so pretty they are, guys. Mm. 
what was that? It's easier pushing around whichever like three or four of them I have. Yes, that one might go for the hook bait. Yes, he's looking, he's looking. He might go for it, no? No. It's close, that's close. He definitely was inspecting it well, you know? See, as the hook bait moves, they are definitely like coming closer to it. <laughs> that one is mopping everything now. Free chub in the area. Come on, this one just eats that hook bait. No. I mean, and in that fast flow, they are so good at detecting, you know, they're insane. This one looked, no. This one is feeding. I was chasing the pellet downstream. Impressive stuff. Wow, that biggie, that one which I tamed almost, one behind, smaller one, moved out and small fish are back. <laughs> that is a good job guys, definitely a very good job I think. Good frame, big head and everything. Just chucked some pellet, just we'll see, one went past, see how that chub is feeding, wow. And the, another one is coming, looked at the bait and then got spooked of it. Wow. Another one is coming just further. Probably this one is the biggest, you know, of, of the group and and uh, it's chasing over once away almost. But another one is coming close to the hook bait. I think, I uh, know, just, but yeah, it's close to the hook bait, I think. Now this one is, that one from behind. No. <laughs> look, 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 look. I was thinking this one will go for it, but no. Chucked some bait in now, they will be back in, in a sec. See, those pellets just went past and those chubs were almost chasing them. Wow. Some smaller one is coming in, just look. That bigger one just kind of kicked, kicked with the tail to the side of that smaller one. Here now four chub I think in my peg. Just this biggest kind of blocking the, the, the shot. This one is coming towards the hook bait. No. <laughs> very very cool. They are competing now. See? They are pushing pushing properly each other. Three chub now, can see four chub and some days, I don't know, five chub I think it was at some point. And yet I, I can't hook one, at least can't hook it easy, you know? Just look, 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 how about that? They are mopping everything up. That is lovely, guys. How many of them I have in the screen, not too sure, at least three or four. Now just two can see. I was thinking this one will go for it, but no. I really got them feeding with, with those small pellets. See, they are pushing themselves and, you know, just... This is what you want. Five chub I think I saw just in the shot. Wow.
see they are competing <laughs> for every pellet see pushing each other that is lovely guys that is nice very very nice they are like buses but as you say they are very very good of telling a difference what they can eat and what they can't eat seems that now they are just eating moving baits come on just eat that muscle they are properly going for it competing I don't know five fish or what I have just look I have full screen of chub <laughs> very very cool maybe I will, I will catch this one no wow I really got them competing guys even though we have a few big fish in the area and they have I mean they should be nailing really the hook bait but they are not as they say they are very good at detecting stuff They are not too bothered about my rig, they are kind of going above it, you know, without, without a worry. They're just not taking my hook bait, which is visible and good, you know, they should be taking it as well. But they just see the hook, I guess, or the lion. So still, uh, I mean, obviously I won't catch hundreds of them, but I will get one or two bites I think I mean I had a couple of attempts already but just did not hook anything wow what's that four four chub it was in this shot just look 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 how about that that one is mopping something just look, they are going darting around properly for them pellets. Just look at that. And millions behind this one as well. <laughs> very bright I mean uh, if it would be you know night time obviously and if I would have the same situation with that many chub competing I would be getting bites every minute you know but now just look <laughs> ridiculous amount of chub four four you now in the shot and every single of them is mopping you know something up that is so cool so cool Just look at that. He's a beauty. He's a beauty. And a few behind them as well. Wow. Just look at that. Wow, guys. <laughs> Very nice television. Just lovely to see them in that fast flow, you know. Just look. They are working very hard you know to just to stay in that flow but still they are managing to avoid my hook bait just chucked some bait and just you will see they will go for it in a sec
No, yeah, my pellets are coming through now. It just looks they are mopping everything up. Wow, it just look some smaller one as well. <laughs> they are pretty fish, guys. You have to say those chubs, they are very, very beautiful fish. This one is feeding close to the hook bait. No, did not go for it. This one is looking. It's close. I know. Just was hovering for a bit. Still very, very cool. Just look, three of them. Every single of them is, you know, eating and looking for something. And they are good size as well, some of them. But I'm certain if I will hook, I, I don't think I will hook the biggest one. Would be very, very surprised if I will hook that, that one which looks like a bus. Wow, they are moving very well around guys very very well they are moving just look three of them four of them wow just look at that <laughs> They are enjoying, you know, being in that fast water, definitely enjoying. It's summer, water is good temperature, about 18, 19 degrees, so it's perfect for them, full of oxygen as well. And they love them pellets as well, which I'm chucking in. This one looked, got him. No, spat out. Did you see that? Actually, but this one moved my lead. I was thinking I got him, you know. Just came from nowhere and I think, I was thinking I got him, but no. So what was that? Four attempts already, you know, and I hooked like and landed zero. And I have a camera underwater. I mean, uh, probably in like real situation, you would be like if you would feed okay in a good area you would get even more fish you know now i will have to recast because my hook bait is you know a little bit out of the shot unless i will hook this one now it's close we'll leave it there for a minute i think before recasting so many chub in the area here now wow thinking this one will go for it. It's close, no? This, that one behind just is hovering quite close to the hook bait. Just go for it. Just eat it. Yes, eat it, eat it, no? Eating very close to the hook bait, but... Wow. look at that how they are moving quickly just to grab some pellets impressive <laughs> that is cool shot guys Very, very cool shot. <laughs> wow, that one just came from behind the camera almost. A couple of like good, good sized chub now showing constantly. Okay, I think I recast now, guys. I have to recast maybe. I'll be able to get it on the first cast, you know, and right in the middle of the shot. Okay, let's see if we can do that, actually. Even though I have plenty of chub. Around. <laughs> I 
uh, really don't want to pull it out now just um, I will be risking you know touching a fish with a line don't want to do that uh, definitely yeah but I have to do that okay let's let's reel in I guess even though one chub is looking it's very close to the hook bait cannot believe it's like probably a couple centimeters away from the hook bait but my hook bait is about to be pushed out of the shot which is no good <laughs> just some chub probably pushed it back a little bit still not the best place edge of the shot yeah let's reel in and we'll see you know <laughs> just look at that <laughs> Uh, they, uh, they are good good fishies right I'm about to cast but I have a chub let's see how it will respond you know I won't be surprised if I will get one on the drop landed okay I think I touched that chub with the line will drag just a little bit just a little bit more yeah now it's perfect now it's perfect Sometimes our chub just kind of stops just above the or below the hook bait, you know, and just kind of watches it for a couple seconds, you know, just looking for something being wrong with it. And once they see the hook, obviously, most likely they see the hook or how it moves or something, then they leave it. This big one is, wow, that is a big, big old chub, guys. I mean, I have everything perfectly, fluorocarbon everywhere. If you think about it, they should not be able to see it that well. But they are seeing something. Very likely that they are ignoring static baits, even though my that muscle meat sometimes, you know, moves a little bit, like up or down, and maybe this is what they don't like. But again, they are taking, see, they are taking rolling pellets, like, all the time, them chub. My trap is set correctly, like I have hook bait right in the middle more or less, lead in the corner. Those chub are not too fussy about my rig, they definitely are okay to swim above my rig. But they are not eating my hook bait, even though my hook bait is the like, biggest thing in the, in the peg, you know. Like in any other situation with any other fish, like big fish, they would eat it the first thing, but not with the chub, obviously, as, as we can clearly see. Come on, take it, no? <laughs> Couple chub just went past. Downstream, actually. <laughs> coming back two two are coming back wow just look they are so fast look look they are eating those two ones come on go for it yeah I was thinking it will go for it but no Wow, it's so nice to f when they are feeding on them pellets. So nice, guys. So yeah, guys, I'm losing the light, so I will call it. Even though I have not hooked any chub today, I think I was fishing okay for them. I mean, when it comes to the ledgering, if I would have, like, float fished, I would have hooked plenty of chub, you know, but then I would not be able to film them how they feed, how they react to the rig. So yeah, I definitely learned plenty. And the, probably the most important bit is that when you are hooking a chub on the ledger, it just means that you have plenty of them around and they are competing. Even though I had some competition in front of camera today, but just was not enough, I think. So yeah, guys. 
hope you enjoyed this video. You saw plenty of chub. You see just one now as well. Probably that one came in to say goodbye. So yeah, again, thanks for watching and see you in the next one.